Hello everyone, this is Nyla. Welcome, welcome to day 10 of our island. That's right, day 10. Now, I have a question for all of you. So, day 12 will be on Saturday. Saturday the 23rd of December. So, do you want me to celebrate Toy Day on the 23rd video, or would you like me to do a special Q&A of Toy Day for Sunday, Christmas Eve? Let me know. Let me know what you would like to see. So without further ado, let's get right into it. I apologize if you hear any loud cars outside my window. I literally cannot just stop the traffic and be like, hey, go away. I'm trying to record a video. So this is Kit Kat. This is Kit Kat's yard. So my thought for him was, you know, punching bag, barbell, tool shelf on one side and then on the other side he's got his stereo, his pinball machine and this is where he throws his laundry in after he works out. He puts his wash in here and then while the washer is doing its thing he plays pinball while listening to the stereo and then once it's done he hangs it up to dry and then after that he, he probably goes and relaxes in his house. So uh, that that's his yard. Hopefully you like it. If you don't that's okay but I feel like it's a really good yard for him. And then over here we have a Christmas tree and a little Kwanzaa, little Kwanzaa thing. Because Christmas is not the only holiday out there. There are many, many holidays and many different traditions out there. So I hope everyone has a great holiday season, no matter which holiday you're celebrating. Happy holidays, everyone. And then over here, this is Quinn's area. She's kind of like Santa's helpers. She's getting gifts for everyone on the island. So these are just some of the gifts that she's giving. For example, she got the rock guitar for Kid Cat. Because she and Kid Cat were the first two on the island. So they're very close. Hey Cephalobot, how's it going? Oh, and if you missed uh, if you missed the last video for some reason, we got Gaston and uh, Cephalobot as our last two villagers. So let me go ahead and load up my map. So now we have Lopez, Quinn, Queenie, Kit Kat, Eric, Filbert, Gaston, Mary, Cephalobot, and Lily. And I would say we have fulfilled the conditions of having two winter themed villagers because obviously Eric fits as a winter villager. And I think Filbert and Mary could also fit as winter villagers. Lopez is kind of, he's kind of neutral, so I don't know if he technically fits that criteria or not, but he certainly could work. And then over here is uh, Cephalobot's yard. Cephalobot, I decided to keep it pretty simple, because he is a smug, so he's got a snow globe, he's got a little ring toss game, he's got a bird bath, a, Tropery and he keeps his clothes over here out to dry. So you know, pretty simple, pretty basic, but not every not every outside design has to be super complicated. I'm not gonna be filling every single space on the island. I don't have that kind of time. So now we're gonna go over here and I'm going to show you Mary. Mary's not done yet. I'm probably gonna add more. Right now she's just got her favorite her favorite sweater that her mom crocheted for her and she's got this this table and chair. Hold on, there's a balloon. I gotta get the balloon. It might be a DIY. Alright, let's see, what is it? It is silk pants. If we put that on, it'll probably get rid of our dress. So this is uh, Filbert. This is Filbert's house. He's got a he's got a pet hamster. He's got this little futon outside because sometimes he likes to sleep outside rather than inside. Got the cardboard boxes back here because he's got lots of stuff. And I figure you know he's a little messy, so he's got some tangled cords in his yard. So that's, that's his yard. I'm not sure if I'm going to add anything more to it or not. And then over here, 
Over here is Lily's yard. And she's got the outdoor bath. She's got some some little plants. She's got a water pump. She's got a little bit of fencing. She's got a telescope so that she could look out to the scar the stars, not scars. That I can't talk today. But anyway, that that is her yard. And then she's got this deer. Alright, let's see, who else has a yard? Oh yeah, let's go this way. And over here. Excuse me! Hello? Can... Fine, I'll go around. I'll go around, they're having a conversation. I already showed you, uh... Kit Kat. So let's show you Eric. Eric, again, pretty simple. I gave him my mailbox and put a scattered papers in front of his mailbox. So basically, he hasn't checked his mail in a while, so it's like overflowing. So I'm using the scattered papers to show that. And then I decided to give him the popcorn machine and I got the uh, ice cream lamp out of a balloon. So I thought that was good some log stakes on each side and a trash can and a record player over here so that's his yard and then if we go over here this isn't anyone's yard but if you remember i was telling you i was going to do this here's rudolph and here's uh oh how does the odor go uh you know Dasher and Dancer and Comet and Vixen, Comet and Cupid and Donner and Blitzen. Yeah, that's how it goes. Oh, please, please don't sue me for trying to remember how the reindeer go. Um, oh hey, here's a snowball. You think we can make a perfect snowboy? I've been having trouble with it lately. There's a lot of flowers in this area too is gonna make it complicated. Hold on, don't let it don't let it get to the edge. Okay, just roll it back there. Okay. Roll in, roll in, roll in. Come on. Just let me get this right. Don't make me look bad on camera. They're way too far apart. They need to be closer than that. Yes, I did it! Oh, wow, maybe I could just only do this on camera. Every time I try to do it off camera, I mess it up. Frozen table? Cool. Hey, Jan! Yay! We'll get that in a minute. Alright, let's go up here. Because I wanted to show you. I wanted to show you one more thing. Uh, I haven't really done a yard for Gaston yet. I just put some flowers. Some flowers in front of his house. You know, being lazy. And then I made this. I made this ramp. 
for him. So I don't know what I'm going to put in front here yet, but I'll, I'll think of something. I will, I will definitely think of something. In the meantime, let's go get this balloon. Shall we get the balloon? Oops, I can't get it from there. Hold on. Wait. Wait. Steady. Aim, fire. <coughs> Alright, we got an incense burner. Ooh. I'm trying my best not to give everyone like the same stuff for the yard. Queenie, Queenie doesn't really have a dedicated yard yet, but I'll go show you. I'll go show you how it's looking. So Queenie's over here, and right now she's just got this cardboard box. But I have a plan. I have a plan for Queenie, and I think we are going to move her house. I think I'm going to move Queenie. I think I'm going to move her over here. Ignore this uh, snow boy. He's one of the ones I tried to roll up with Robin's advice. But I must have done something wrong because he's not perfect. So just... I'm thinking, you know, this pathway will lead up to her house. And her house will be back here in the corner. And then she could have, like, a yard right here. That's what I'm thinking. So that's uh, that's the update for now. I have not done any terraforming at all. Well, I've obviously made pathways, but I haven't done... I have not changed any rivers. I have not changed any cliffs. Everything is the way it was when I started. Alright, so, now, check my pockets, we still have Brewster's, I did decide to get Brewster's photo, wait, did I put it away? I must have put it away. Well, I did decide to get Brewster's photo in case I wanted to go get him. I still haven't really decided if I'm going to bother yet. I just, I just don't know. It might be worth it to go to a capital and just to see what's there. Gotta go to at least one, right? But yeah, I've been I've been working hard off of off of camera and like figuring out how much to show, how much not to show, while still being able to do this in twelve days. It's hard because I feel like you're 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 missing out on all like some of the some of the lore of this island but it's coming together it's really coming together all right i'm gonna go put my stuff away and then i think we will go on a captain tour put something away put all that stuff away i don't need it right now good all right so, let's talk. But that is something that he said. He said, I bet no one has done something like that. And I'm like, yeah, that sounds, that sounds really hard. So what, what do you think? What do you think of his idea? I can obviously think on it for a while, but I also had another idea where I could do some kind of, you know, 30-day core, 30-day core island where I build, you know, kid core, cottage core, fairy core, some kind of core. And for me, the challenge, the most challenging one, I think, for me would be city core, mostly because I'm not great at terraforming. And yeah, I, I don't know how to make it look fancy like some people do. I tried my best, like Batty Cove turned out really well, but that was still mostly somebody else's code. So I'm like, what if I did a 30 day island where I don't use any custom codes that I don't make myself? That would be a challenge. And it would be unique because I would be making all the codes for the island. 
So let, let me know. Let me know what you think. I'm interested in your opinion. But we will be starting a brand new island January 2nd, which is a Tuesday, on stream. So whatever idea we come up with, I want I want to make sure everyone that watches these videos is provided with quality entertainment. And I want to also make sure that I'm not putting too much pressure on myself to create these videos. Because that's a thing too. All right, I've uh, I've spouted on long enough. Let's let's go. Let's go. All right, Kappa. You can take me to a good island. doesn't look like a rare island. So is there anything we even want? Obviously we can go get Brewster. Oh, maybe we'll get a good DIY. Natural, really? I... Alright, let's go get Brewster. What a disappointment. Hey Brewster. Oh, there's a mums. Maybe it'll be useful. I highly doubt yeah, I'll get the mom cushion in the next few days, but maybe I can use these for something. strip this island bare for all its resources, but there's really no point. There's really no point to doing that. Alright. I'm gonna go over here in front of this coconut tree. Down. Sit our butt down. Oh darn it. Sit. There. Got our thumbnail. Alright, let's go. I'm ready to go home. Yeah, I know. Let's do some kind of- oh yeah, yoga. Alright, that's good. Oh, 
All right, so yeah, most of the villagers have a decorated area. There's just a few more things I need to do. I really need to make Mary's look a little better. Hers is kind of very, very basic. So if you have any ideas what would be good for her, I, I obviously don't have a whole lot of stuff, but I have some stuff. Maybe the well. The brick well would go well. That takes clay, wood, and a flimsy shovel. I could probably go build that now. Give her something, you know? Alright, let's go build that now. Because if I don't do it now, I'll forget to do it later. Get something out. Okay, we need wood. Specifically hardwood, I think it said. Hardwood and a flimsy shovel. Do I need tree branches for a flimsy shovel? I don't remember. Why can't I remember this stuff? Yes, let's craft something. Okay, we're going to make a flimsy shovel. And then we're going to go down here. Where is it? Alright, that should definitely be enough. Put away. I'm not even gonna bother with the gyroids. Alright, and let's grab a couple of these flowers too. I do need to put them somewhere, so... Let's try a mixture of red and white. One more white. Four ought to be enough. I'll figure out where to put the rest of them. Ah! No, I didn't want to do that. No, it's okay. It's okay. Sometimes you do things that you don't want to do. Let's go over to Mary's house, and I think we'll put her flowers, at least one of them, like, right here. Let's go with yellow, well, not yellow, white, and then let's put another one over here. And then let's try to, like, make it opposite, red. Yep, I like that. Alright, now the brick well can go right here. I kind of want to push it over. No? Hold on. Let me see if I can put it right here. Okay, fine. That's that's fine, we'll just push it back. Let's push it back. And then push it over. Now let's push it down. Get right about there. And this will be the perfect spot for the pot kind of want it to be in front. Yeah. And then we'll put the frozen sculpture. Should we put it behind? 
Should we put it behind or should we put it in front? Oh, that's definitely not going to work over here. Well, let me move this and put the sculpture like in the back. Let's put it in the back. That's like her tree. Should it be there? No, it should be closer to her house. Maybe further in. How does that look? Now you can't see it at all. You know what? I think I think the solution here is this tree is a problem. There, she can she can keep the stump. You, you can't really see it from there. What about here? No wrong button. tree is still in the way. Hey Lily, what's up? Do you know about Glee? It's one of my most favorite reactions, Nai Nai. Watch this. So I just discovered a great apple strudel recipe. That's a good way to show everyone that your heart is full of Glee. Yay! Thank you, Lily. But yeah, that, that tree was ultimately too much of a problem. What is this? Ah, it's a natural garden table. You know, we can still fit that here. How do I fit it right here? We can have a table right here, right next to the path. And maybe scoot it in. This one. Should we put the chair, like, right here? Or should we put the chair right here? I'm leaning on right here. I'm probably not going to be able to push it. Hold on. No. Right there is fine. There. That's good. I think maybe if I just put one more thing right here. Maybe some illuminated snowflakes. It'll it'll be all done. So let's see. The only house left that I really need to do is I need to move Queenie and I need to work on this stand. So I will do that off camera because we are uh, we are past the 30 minute mark according to my clock. So uh da 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 Check her nook miles real quick. How do we do that thing Robin said? She said go down. Wait, wait, wait. There it is. Yay! Let's go ahead and sit. Oh, I got I got to get into camera mode first. Let's go ahead and sit. All right, everyone. Let let me know what you thought of the video. I realized that this video was a lot of me talking and not a whole lot of play. So, uh, I apologize if that's a problem. I I will try my best to be better about it. And if you heard any loud room in the video, I, I apologize. I'm still learning how to edit those noises out. So hopefully it won't be too bad. Lily says hopefully it's not bad. She wants, you know, she wants everyone to be happy. I was trying to think. Trying to think of something to say. Um... I really, really, really love frogs, 
and I'm running out of room to put my like my frog ceramics on my dresser so uh, if you know any good recommendations for that let me know I can't just drive to IKEA not only do I not drive but I don't have a passport so let me know all right thank you thank you so much for watching remember stay safe stay awesome and always know you're sweet as a pineapple bye everyone See you tomorrow!